I'm going to demonstrate the fluorescence associated with a number of different compounds. Of course, fluorescence is when we expose a substance to a shorter wavelength of light and it emits a longer wavelength once the light interacts with it. So we're going to start with fluorescein. Uh, fluorescein, as you can see, is sort of a yellowish color, but when we expose it to ultraviolet light, it gives us this nice bright green color. I've got a few more here to, um, to show you as well. Um, here's one that I like. This is Eosin Y. So Eosin Y is sort of a peach color. And if we expose it to ultraviolet light, it completely changes color. And so we get this sort of a yellowish uh, to yellowish green um, color that's emitted. The next one that I'm going to show you is Rhodamine B. Rhodamine B is a, a common dye in chemistry, um, and Rhodamine B has got sort of a pinkish red color associated with it, and when I expose my Rhodamine B to my light, then I get sort of an orange-red color from it. The next one that we'll look at is naphthol. I like naphthol because uh, it gives us a really significant color change. So you can see that um, the solution here is clear and colorless, but as soon as I expose it to the ultraviolet light, we get this bright blue uh, color emitted from our solution. And then I have another one that is very similar to that, and that's quinine. So here's some quinine. Quinine is also clear and colorless when it's dissolved into um, uh, a very slightly acidic solution. But when we expose it to the ultraviolet light, you can see it glows very, very brightly. We get this nice bright blue color. Now, <clears throat> quinine is kind of interesting because we can find quinine in the grocery store uh, because it is the, um, one of the ingredients in tonic water. So tonic water um, contains a significant amount of quinine. We've got some tonic water here. You can see that that water's clear and colorless um, as well, the tonic water is. Um, but when I expose it to my ultraviolet light, you can see how brightly uh, blue that glows.